All right, my friends, I know you've had one of those days where you're fishing all day and nothing is going right at all. And then just as the sun is going down, you figure it out, you figure out the pattern and you just start catching a whole bunch of fish. And it's bittersweet because the bite only lasts for a half hour as the sun's going down, but at least you finally found them. That's what we got going on here. You can see about 10 feet into this water. I know it's hard to see right here. Just using four pound line off this dock, trying to find some huge, huge panfish. Thank you guys for watching. It seems that there was either right in front of us or they're way the heck out there. I think one of us is going to get hit there. Good, good one, dude. Bro, this is a pattern, man. This dock thing is a legit pattern. Oh, it's so sketchy with you out here too, bro. Let's turn this ball. How big is this thing? I don't know, but I'm getting the heebie-jeebies, bro. It hasn't fought that hard, it just feels heavy. Bro, nothing makes me nervous like these giant panfish. That's a big one, dude. Big bull, isn't it? Dude, that fight was insane. Nice, thank you, man. It's still not as big as I thought. Look at that. Look at that giant male red ear sunfish, guys, from the docks. What a beast. Insane fight. Dude, it's on. It's on, buddy. Make sure you let the fish go, not your phone. craziest colors like he was like got him dude we have figured this out dude i can't believe this <laughs> he was kind of scoffing at us for going to this one it's a hybrid it's the same thing as what i just caught whatever that is uh it's probably bluegill right here this one's got some insane colors dude this one's got insane colors a lot of, like a lot of purple in it i know that's it oh boy i can't dude these dogs are so sketchy I know. I just can't help but think there's got to be some giant hens in there somewhere, right? Bro. Dude! Dude! <laughs> Bro, this is nuts. This is the most consistent we've had all week, isn't it? up bro I just got nailed buddy yes <laughs> oh my god it's a striper what a rip off bro what a rip off oh my just pulled right there oh dude come it we both got ripped off hard dude you gotta call your brother he's gonna get mad 
Oh, I think there's a channel in front of us where it gets a little deeper. But yeah, there is. Look at you. They're hitting the one that gets in that channel. This is the right kind. Dude, it gets so deep right there. Oh, I just got nailed, dude. Did you hear that? What just happened here? I did. Oh, mine didn't connect. Oh, no. What do you think you got? Hybrid? Yeah, it's gotta be. It's a big hybrid. Wonder if they're all like hybrids or males down there. Dude, that's beautiful. Where was that guy at? Not too far out in front, maybe a quarter of the way across. Oh, that's a that's a big one, dude. That's a nice one. I might have to have you help me with some photos with that one. That's the biggest one. It just didn't fight that hard to be real. Another dark giant hybrid bluegill slash red ear sunfish. This one is super impressive. Just an insane shape. That is an insane fish. Thank you, man. Wow, it's behaving so well too, you know? It is. <laughs> that is a pretty special fish. Right there, my friends. That's insane. Too big to kick off. There she went. <laughs> you guys could hear us talk in this video. Oh, we better get a hold of our friend Zach. But it turns out that he was fishing somewhere else and he called us over to him and he had caught a legitimate three pounder, which was bigger than any of the ones that we had caught from the dock. Dude. Wow. Oh my gosh. What a giant, man. That's something else. <laughs> You're a beast. That's such a big beast. Golly. You need your photos? You fight good? Oh, yeah. Just hold your head back then, yeah. All right, guys, if I get one comment on this video talking about how this is what I use for flathead bait, I'm gonna blow a gasket. These fish were absolutely awesome, and I would never dream of using ones like these as flathead bait. We got some pure red ears in there, and then we had the hybrid red ear bluegills, and I think those were the biggest ones, and that fight was just insane. Last two and a half, three minutes on four pound line with relatively tight drag. Some of the most fun I've ever had fishing a dock for panfish, just I don't care how old you are, catching huge bluegill like that is a blast. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you all enjoyed this one.